Weight loss resolutions are like the family get-togethers that happen once a year. At first, you are happy and enthusiastic to meet everyone, but by the end of it, you're happy that this is a once-in-a-year thing. Metabolism is a huge part of weight loss, diet, and exercise, but it's become a buzzword that just gets thrown around a lot. Let's break it down. Basically, metabolism is the amount of energy that your body needs to function. Sounds simple, right? Well, not quite. There are a ton of misconceptions about what this really means and how you make your metabolism faster. We're here to set the record straight. We're diving into the five most common mistakes people make when they think about metabolism. Mistake one, skipping weight training. Skipping weight training is a big no-no, but it's one of the most common mistakes people make. A 2012 study showed that a combination of a healthy diet, weight training, and cardio burns the most fat. So ditch the fear of getting bulky and embrace those dumbbells. Mistake two, not getting enough protein. Are you working out, sleeping well, and doing everything right, but still not seeing results? It's probably because you're not packing on the protein. Protein is like a building block for your body. It helps grow and repair the cells and boost metabolism by almost 30%. Whether chicken, egg, or legumes, wherever you prefer, remember that protein is king. Mistake three, not getting enough sleep. Sleeping four hours a night is just not enough. Sleep deprivation can trigger insulin resistance and disrupt the hormones that regulate your appetite. The hashtag hustle is hashtag not worth it. Your body needs at least seven hours of sleep to keep your metabolism running smoothly. Mistake four, eating too less. Yep, you heard that right. Eating too little can cause a dip in your basic metabolic rate or the number of calories you burn when your body is in a state of rest. Don't torture yourself. Fill your stomach with all the right things. And yes, even snacks and candies in moderation. Mistake five, improper breathing. Breathing is involuntary, so it's something we don't really think about. But studies show that if you're mindful of your breath, you could also practice good metabolism. Breathing through your mouth is a big no-no. You're preventing filtration of dust and allergens and reducing oxygen intake. You'll also end up spending a ton on chapstick. Look up techniques like deep breathing, alternate nostril breathing, and Sanobi breathing. When you're on a brisk walk in the park or hitting the gym with your favorite playlist, these breathing techniques can help reduce stress on the body and increase the volume of oxygen your fat molecules get. The greater the oxygen, the more these molecules are broken down and the faster fat disappears. Understanding your metabolic health can change the way you look at fitness, making you work smarter and more effectively. You'll be closer to your goal in no time.